guys and welcome to another day in Iceland. Today we're on the south coast. South uh, coast. Coast. <laughs> Where the cows go moo. Moo. <laughs> we're on the south coast today. We're gonna see some pretty cool things. Two waterfalls, a glacier, yep. some beaches and a petrol station. <laughs> <laughs> This is where we stopped at the moment. Um, we're about done an hour and 40 minutes. We had a good fun start to our day, didn't we, Holly? Mm -hmm. Holly, Holly loves it when things don't go to plan. Well, especially today. Because it's her birthday. Um, do you want to tell everyone a bit about um, what happened? Well, we went to the last pickup. We thought we were the last pickup. We went to the last pickup. And the people weren't there, like the guy got off the bus and everything, went into the reception, tried to find them. And then we randomly stop at a petrol station, not this one, but another one. And then um, had to wait like 15 minutes on these other people showing up. And I'm like, I don't know whether it was their fault or what, but put a damper on my day. And we haven't got the best seats if we're in the bus. No, we're crammed right in the back. We're in the back of the bus. We're in the, we're because there's the... someone that's an individual that sat over two seats when they shouldn't be. They should be sat with an individual seat. But... Holly was saying it is her birthday, so if you do want to send her a gift, so uh, <laughs> please do. It's also the mildest day oh, yeah. we've had since we've been here. It's 10 degrees at the moment, and I have decided to put on thermals underneath my thermal joggers, so um, wish me luck. But we are going to like an oven to be sat beside yeah. on the bus. We are going to the glacier, so it should kind of like cool down at a certain point, so it's not like it's going to be wasted. But um, there you go, guys, we'll update you at the first stop which I believe on our itinerary is the waterfall, but that doesn't mean that's going to be the uh, case because they do it in random orders, but... Yeah, he says we're doing the glacier in the afternoon because the weather will be better. Yeah. So... Makes it, I think he's trying, he thinks that's the best spot, so... Um, that makes sense, they actually know what they're doing. If you use an indicator, then I won't do that to you, <laughs> but they're not using an indicator, so I'm going to do that to you. <laughs> right, let's go. Take it on We are coming up on the left hand side, you see a, uh, a waterfall, it's the Sertjanatsfoss and we will visit this, this waterfall, not now but in the afternoon on our way back to the lake area. Drones are forbidden, oh. Right. Oh. Yeah, it's a little bit wet today, isn't it? like back home where it's just a plenty. Yeah. So, so we're here at the um, what waterfall. Oh, Skogla Fox. There you go. And um, the waterfall's right in front of us, you can see it. You've also got a choice of walking up these steps. Uh, these steps, about 500 steps up, and there's a viewing platform above. Um, yeah. Uh, me and Holly, just off camera, decided that um, due to the fact we're going on a hike through the glacier later, we're going to save our legs <laughs> and just have a look at the uh, waterfall from below. I can't really see the spray coming off it until I do that. So we just got to see how close we can get. We're already getting soaked now, but I'm going to put the camera away. The next shot you'll see is the closest we can get without like destroying my camera. So see you in a second. Holly! A little bit! That's how close we are! Quickly! Before my camera like dies because of wetness! <laughs> oh, so there you go guys, we've got um, a five minute stop to see the uh, the view. <laughs> it's a little bit rainy today. There's a church though. So uh, here's the church. This is Vic, by the way. Um, and that's it. Um, uh, it's one of the main largest so just, just posing for my, my awesome view picture. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, one of the main towns on the highway one. But I think that's it. I might just quickly run around and see if there's a better view over here. <laughs> oh. oh, look at this wonderful view. Right, I'm going back in, it's wet. And the view is terrible. <laughs> so we made it to the black sand beaches um, just outside of Vic um, again the weather is not good today um, obviously it being Holly's birthday and she's bringing the Scottish weather with us oh, don't blame me that's not fair <laughs> um, 
So we got told it's yellow warning today, which is semi-bad. <laughs> and he was also saying, when on these beaches, don't go close than 60 feet to the water. Is that right? Yeah, because the waves will take the, the, yeah. the unpredictable waves. So um, yeah, this is going to be quite a little bit different. Yeah, look, it says it here. Deadly sneaker wave. Supervised children. Ooh. Yellow light, do not go past the yellow zone on the map. Oh yeah, the red. The red is literally, don't go any past that point here. <laughs> wow. Don't go past the yellow zone, don't go past the red zone if you're in red. <laughs> don't go be beyond this point if it's red, if it's red. <laughs> wow. Oh wow. Yeah, and um, don't go where it's wet. Oh. Famous rocks on the beaches, but again, you can't really see it because the weather. But... Oh my god, idiots! Oh, maybe we'll get to see another idiot today. So, me and Holly are, um, are making this really nice blog for you, and it's quite a funny blog. If you want to read it, the link's in the description. But um, the blog itself is called um, Idiots of Iceland, and it's just about all the idiots that we've seen in Iceland. And it's quite a couple of funny stories, little anecdotes. Yeah, so check out the uh, blog, it's in the link below. Okay. okay. So that's your skier cake. That's a chocolate and caramel cake. It's vegan. Like vegan, yeah. Lots of the stuff up here is vegan. They're very good on their oat milk and their stuff like that as well, so that's good. I've got a mocha and you've got a cappuccino. Looks good. Um, also, we've got some onion rings coming just for some hot food. <laughs> it's super weird that it's so warm right now. Like. As much as it is absolutely horrible weather. Um, yeah, I'm not cool. The last thing you'd expect right now is to see a glacier. Yeah. <laughs> so apparently that's what we're going to go see. Now apparently it's shrinking by 10 metres a year. Yep. Um, so apparently it's going to be quite impressive by the sounds of it, but um, who knows? Uh, it's horrible weather out right now. <laughs> it's like really fine rain. Um, not much else I can say about this. I'll show you when we get there, like the hike looks a bit... You said it's an easy path. Yeah. I don't look too bad. Um, yeah, we're going to stop filming because it's my camera's just getting soaked. Oh wow, right up there. Oh, you see... Mm. Just really started raining heavy now. Um, hopefully you can see it on the camera guys, but... It's uh, really cool. Just gonna block, get Holly to pop me for something. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That's, it goes right up that mountain. It's a bit foggy, so you probably won't be able to see it here. I can barely see it myself. But um, that's what it looks like. So the glacier is massive. You can see how it's carved its way in the landscape and stuff. So the glacier would have been all the way down here, carving its way down here, if you can just see it, it's foggy as anything. Um, yeah, it's obviously all melting now, but that's really cool. That's like last day ice, ice age. <laughs> so if you've watched our Iceland series so far, you'll know that we've had some really good days actually, haven't we? Yeah. Um, it's been quite clear. This has been like a, this has been the worst day that we've had. Um, yesterday was very windy. Um, I think that was due to the area we're in more than anything. And today it's really quite wet. Um, looking at the weather forecast for next week, 
it's wet literally all week. So we got lucky, really lucky with our weather. Um, as much as today has been a pretty damp day. Um, we have decided to come down and walk to the bottom of the uh, valley and see the glaciers. So uh, hopefully we'll get up close and personal with them in a second. The rain's so on and off at the moment. Um, so it's just a quick clip, just in case I don't get much closer to it. Absolutely getting really wet again. All right, okay, sorry guys, as much as I'd love to film more of these and how impressive they look. Oh, it, it's slowing down, right? Oh, I don't know. Um, I'm trying not to get my camera too wet and break my camera because it would be a really pointless thing to do, break my camera for a couple of pictures. Looks so amazing. Anyway, right, next time you see me is at the waterfall, guys. I'll see you underneath the waterfall, maybe? Who knows? Alright. Oh, let's see if I can get some good pictures of this, guys. So we're at the waterfall, the um, Selgalafoss waterfall. Um, and um, we can walk around this waterfall. Um, they said you might get wet. We are already soaked, so um, let's, let's go for it. Um, there's a couple of cafes and a little shop here afterwards. Um, again, filming's gonna be quite lax because um, I don't wanna get this camera too wet. Well, the rain is heavy. Um, I'm trying to hold the camera away. The light's getting dark, so um, let's just see how well I can do on this. All right, guys? There you go, guys. We are underneath the waterfall. It's actually a little bit drier underneath here, which um, surprisingly, the waterfall is vicious. Um, you have to climb over some rocks while getting completely sprayed, which is great fun. Um, it's lovely though, it's a really cool waterfall. I've never been under a waterfall before. And it gets slightly wet, but not like overly. I'm trying to tell the camera it's a bit glare, oh, very glary. I don't know how well you can hear me, because it is really... Does it say 25, 30 meters, do you reckon? 200 meters, John. What? The oh, deep, I mean the, the waterfall. Yeah. So there you go guys, that is... <laughs> Honestly! Honestly! <laughs> what? We're soaking through and you still care about aesthetic. Yeah, I want people to care about my videos. So anyway guys, that is the uh, south of Iceland. We've really enjoyed it. Oh, well, minus the how wet we got. Um, so I'm gonna say, what else you see next, or next week's video is gonna be a very short one. It's kind of a bit of a recap video of the whole of Iceland series and showing you the airport. Um, anything else we're gonna show you tomorrow? Probably that's mainly it. Yeah. It's just a little bit of a recap video. But thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you again. 